Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to go over using multiple audio tracks in Doodly. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. By default, Doodly has two audio tracks, one for music and one for your narration. Now this is great for most videos. It's got the basics covered, right? You've got background music and you've got a narration track. Now, what if you wanted to add some sound effects or maybe have some different voices come in? Well, it gets a little more complicated then, doesn't it? Fortunately, you can easily add audio tracks in Doodly. You'll see here that I've already started a video. I've got Going to the dentist can be scary, and it looks like we're going to promote a ebook or a physical book. And we have a little bit of information here about the book, as well as a call to action. So it's a very simple little video, and it's going to need some audio. So I'm going to go ahead and import the standard tracks, and I'm going to do that really quickly because we've gone over this before, okay? So I'm, I'm in sounds and I've got this blue plus sign. I'm just going to browse for my file. And now that I have it, I'm just going to drag and drop it into my video. And I'm using the narration track. This, this is a nice little label. I could put it in the music. It doesn't really matter. But the label is nice. It tells me, OK, this is my voice track. OK, so that is there. And then maybe we're going to add some background music. My video is just over a minute long, so I'm going to want music that's going to fit in that time period. Let's just pick this one. I always like to turn it down way, way, way down, especially when I have a voiceover. So I'm going to go down to 14%. And I'm just going to trim it down here. Now this is all review if you've been following these tutorials we've gone over this quite a bit so I'm almost done so bear with me right click fade out stretch that out and okay so now let's take a look at this I may need to do some fine-tuning to make sure the timing is correct and I'll do that offline so that you don't have to sit through this but let's just take a quick look when you're going to the dentist for a checkup, it can be scary. It's easy to feel anxious and stressed about the whole ordeal, but don't worry. It's okay to be nervous about your... So that gives you kind of an idea of what I have going on. Like I say, I'm going to do some editing offline and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I just did some fine tuning of the video so that the images match my voice. So let's just take a quick preview of the beginning part and see how that is looking. When you're going to the dentist for a checkup, it can be scary. It's easy to feel anxious and stressed about the whole ordeal, but don't worry. Now in this section here, I have a plan, so I have some timing here. It's okay to be nervous about your next dental visit. And then that just The continues. dental visit survival. You notice I have a gap here of empty sound. And I recorded that that way because I'm anticipating having this character's voice come in here. So I have a scared character and I want his voice to come in. So I wanted to leave space so he could say what he needs to say. And hopefully I left the right amount of space. And then I also wanted some sound effects. So let's start with the sound effects. So what I need to do first is I need to get a new track because this is full and this is full. I can't add sound effects because there's nowhere to go. So all I need to do is click on one of these tracks, the three dots, and choose add track. So now I have an empty track here. It says uh, music. That's the music label, but it's okay. We know that it's going to be what it is. And in this case, it's going to be sound effect. So we need to go over here to our sounds tab, category, sound effects. And then we need to pick some noises that sound scary. 
So let's just take a quick look. Sci-fi laser, maybe? Yeah, that sounds good. So let's just throw that in there. And then we just can move it. And let's see what else. Jackhammer, that will be perfect. Since there's space in the sound effect track, I can just use it in here wherever I'd like. If I'd like to keep them separate, I can add another track, but I think this will be fine. So let's take a quick listen now. When you're going to the dentist for a checkup, it can be scary. It's easy to feel anxious and stressed about the whole ordeal, but don't worry. Okay, and let's add some more jackhammer. Let's have some at the beginning here. And I think that's good. We might want to add some more throughout this whole scene if we'd like. But for now, I think that's great. And we need a new track because now we want this voice to come in, okay? So I have a man speaking and we'll hear it in just a moment. So again, I just go in and I click Add Track. And so now I have a whole nother track here. So let's get out of the sound effects tab and just go to all. And that brings back this little blue plus sign. And I'm gonna upload my character's voice. So once again, I'm just gonna browse for it. And my husband was kind enough to voice this character for me last night. So here it is. And we're just going to drag it in. And he did two takes. So you'll see I have the first one and the second one. They have different words. So let's see which one we like better. Oh no, this is really gonna hurt. I don't think I could do this. It's okay no, to no, be no, nervous I'm about not... Okay, so I could actually use both of them if I'd like because there's plenty of time. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get rid of the second one. And here, let's have a little overlap with me talking. Let's see how that sounds here for the first one. But don't oh, worry. No, this. No, I don't like it overlapping. I need it a little more. And honestly, I'm gonna turn this voiceover down even. I mean, the music down even more. So now let's see. Gil. But don't worry. Oh no, this is really gonna hurt. I don't think I can do this. And that's good. And if I wanted, I could even have him say this at the beginning, and then I could drag my voiceover down. And I think I'd like to do that. I'll need to adjust everything downstream, and I'll do that on my own, but let's just take a look and see how that's starting to go. Oh no, this is really gonna hurt. I don't think I can do this. When you're going to the dentist for a checkup, it can be... So yeah, I'm gonna have his voice come in first and I'm going to just drag everything down like so. Cause I don't want him talking until he's drawn on. So that makes more sense there. And then I'm gonna move my voice down even further. So see how, since they're on separate tracks, it's really easy to make these adjustments. So let's go ahead and start it from the beginning. Oh no, this is really going to hurt. I don't think I can do this. When you're going to the dentist for a checkup, it can be scary. It's easy to feel anxious and stressed. Okay, so now I need to obviously make some adjustments to my scene. Make it even longer. Actually, I'm gonna make it longer here, just for now. I mean, I'll fine tune all of this on my own, but this gives us some room to work with. So now I want this second part where he's like, oh no, I don't wanna get in that chair, no way. So let's go ahead. We wanna get this same voiceover. So I'm gonna right click it and choose duplicate. And I'm gonna move it over here. Now I don't want him saying the same thing, right? He's already said that, but if you recall, I had two different 
sections to this. So I'm revealing the new section and now I'm going to hide this section. So now I have where he says that he doesn't want to get in the chair. So now let's see. Asked about the whole ordeal, but don't worry. No, 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 I'm not getting in that chair. <laughs> so then let's just close this up. It needs to be more like 17 seconds. And now I need to adjust this audio here so that I start speaking at the beginning of the scene. And I'm going to once again add a track just to keep it interesting here. So now I have a blank track and I'm going to, I've showed you this technique before. I think showing it to you multiple times is helpful because sometimes you don't get it the first time. So once again, I'm just going to duplicate it. And then I have to find it. It's going to be way over here. See how it adds it at the end. So I'm just going to put it on top and then I'm just going to drag it over into place. So now I have two identical tracks. So I want the bottom one to stay fixed where it is. Okay. So now I'm just going to get rid of this and the bottom one stays where it is. So I want to keep this front part. So we're focusing on the bottom one. And now we're getting rid of the ending because this is duplicated, right? So we're basically splitting this single file into two separate tracks. Okay, so now I have the beginning and now I have the ending. And now I can move them and tighten them. So that's the beginning. And so he says, no, 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 I'm not getting in the chair here. Okay, so then I want my voice to come in as soon as he does that. And this is right where my scene is changing. So he's going to say, no, 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 I'm not getting in that chair. And then my scene changes. Now, since I do have some effects that happen downstream, I do need to move them over so that they work. I don't think I have any other effects beyond that. I'm going to have to do some more editing. I will do that offline again just to make the timing work because I did adjust some audio here. So I do need to readjust the timing. But we're only worried about this part anyway because this is the part with the multiple tracks that I wanted to show you. You'll, you may notice I have subtitles going on. That was just for my own purposes. I may or may not want to publish it with subtitles. In this example, we can turn them off. So I go to settings and subtitles off. And let's go ahead and preview it. Oh no, this is really gonna hurt. I don't think I can do this. When you're going to the dentist for a checkup, it can be scary. It's easy to feel anxious and stressed about the whole ordeal, but don't worry. No, 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 I'm not getting in that chair. Oh. It's okay to be nervous about your next dental visit. Mm -hmm. The dental visit survives. And that's the basics of working with multiple audio tracks in Doodly. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.